We got scammed, but guys. She got scammed. Well, like, yeah, because I'm living there too. Yeah, I know, but sometimes guys really don't care. Like not this one. Yeah, not this one, guys. <laughs> What's up and welcome back to my channel. My name is Taylor if you're new here. Today I am with Christian and Cooper, mm -hmm. both the C's in my life. Today's video, we're just gonna walk you guys through some more apartments um, that we toured before the quarantine. Right now our apartment hunt is on pause. If you guys watched my last video, I kind of went into more detail with it. But basically it's on pause for now until Christian can go back to work because yeah, I he, paid. he's not getting paid right now. No one I mean, at his You job. don't see patients and we don't get paid. Ooh, okay, well. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. It's teaching us a lot of patience and it's teaching us to like shift our perspective with the whole process and not to be like super annoyed that we're not in control because God has a plan for us and it's just not to move in together right now. I guess not. We just get to spend more time with our family. Um, I guess we'll start off with our the second apartment that we saw. I already posted a first moving vlog where we toured one apartment. This is the second one. We'll show you guys the different layouts that we toured and then we'll tell you guys our thoughts on everything afterwards. All right, so starting off the bat, what we liked about this apartment and honestly something that's on our wish list for every apartment that we see is to have an at-home gym or like a gym in the complex mm -hmm. so this apartment had that which was really nice they brand had, new too yeah it was brand new um that she said that there were only a couple of people living in the apartment so far like there was like a pool table like a little kitchen a little lounge area but then the first layout she showed us was a corner layout being the first apartment that we see within this complex it was really cool but it was a little bit smaller the bedroom was definitely a lot smaller the bathroom was huge mm -hmm. um but i really did like the black features on the windows i don't know that's just Ooh, something the closet. that i like yes the closet for her yeah that was a tiny closet no it was huge it was a big walk-in closet um, you didn't see it I thought it was kind of tiny. One of the other layouts, it was tiny. Um, but yeah, we liked the finishes, like how there's like white cabinets. Mm. Um, Not a lot of new, cabinet space in this one though. Yeah, new appliances. Um, but yeah, this layout was pretty standard. I didn't see this one online, so this was definitely new to me, like to see it in person. Um, but yeah. This was the first layout. This is the layout we liked the most, right? Yes. We loved the kitchen. It was so huge and like there was tons of cabinet space. Like we don't even have a lot of stuff and we definitely we will have like leftover room in the cabinets. There was just tons of cabinet space. Air fryer. Which is like a plus. Yeah. Right. But I don't want any clutter on my counter so it would be nice to have space to like put everything away. Yes. So the bedroom in here was a lot bigger than the first layout that we saw. Um, pretty standard bedroom. I loved the tall ceilings in it. I loved how much light was coming through. I don't really mind that there was like that air conditioner unit that was like out. Yeah. I mean, I mean it is kind of a sore eye, but like it's not an issue. Everything else was fine. Yeah, everything was pretty much modern and really nice. Um, something that I liked about this unit was that everything was basically all connected. It kind of flo flowed. Flowed? Flowed bathroom again was huge and there was like a washer and dryer unit in there too we loved that unit but then she continued to show us the other layout options there's another unit that has like balconies i didn't like the balcony one yeah the balcony <sighs> one took out a lot of like in the apartment was that the bedroom that was like kind of like yeah weird? but i didn't end up like, like a taking a lot of video about of this yeah because we didn't we didn't like this one like we just knew off the bat like we didn't like it as much as the last one wasn't feeling it wasn't feeling it everything was nice except for like the weird layout of the bedroom i don't know so yeah i ended up showing you guys um the layout that we would get if we signed a lease so she showed us everything without furniture. I love this unit just because there's a lot of closet space. There's a lot of storage for everything. Um, yeah, I mean, there's a lot of pros to this. We were almost like, oh, this is definitely going to be the one. But then we got home and like we started thinking about it more. Our parents were like, do you that really want to be in that area? It's not the best area. 
like there's a lot of good things around it like if you go drive to them but just like the area that it's in it's not that great now that you guys saw the apartment you're like oh my god that's perfect like you guys seem to love it a lot but yeah we started thinking about like the area and stuff and like it's it would take me probably over an hour close to an hour to get to work the only reason we would end up considering this place is if it was like way under our budget yeah it was kind of expensive right especially with like, all like the extra fees the mm -hmm. parking and the or was parking free there no we had to pay and like the amenities for the gym and like the common area and yeah. the office spaces and like, stuff like if that. it was way under budget we would so live there i would just suck it up and do the commute because i'm like it's a brand new building like super nice but again the location wasn't that great and like the price with all the extra amenities it's just not worth it to live there no so the third apartment prime location right off the bat it's how many minutes from your second location that you normally work at mm, like 10 yeah about 10 minutes about 10 minutes and like 25 for this to 30 to the, for the other location the that he works at he works at two different locations so for my job it was probably like a 35 for probably 35 minute drive which is not that bad at all again brand new they actually are finishing up building the building that we would live in um but i think yeah. this gym that they had here had like the most oh to like uh, there's so many more machines she showed us the layout of like a two bedroom but it is fully furnished so like she just wanted to show us the model and like get an idea of all the finishes that would happen because like i said they're finishing up building the building we would live in so like when we went to the other apartments um they're they're not fully like done yet and they you'll see you'll see two bedroom layout is ginormous there's so much window space i was like now that i look at that this, i like that like the the windows like in the corner like that this was definitely different than the other apartments we've looked at because all of the other kitchens were white and like very i don't know light but it did feel very very homey even though it is brown like i don't know i kind of like the white cabinets and like just I'm having indifferent. everything like looked looking clean but the brown surprised me i didn't know yeah. i was gonna like it as much as i did like i like the white like that's what i first started liking but then how i saw this like how it was arranged and stuff like that I, I it's very homey yeah you said that a lot oh did I? Okay, whatever. It's really homey to me. So yeah, she was showing us a lot of the one bedrooms. This one was our favorite model to look at. It, it had a yeah. huge balcony. Like it went from the family room all the way to the bedroom. Um, also had a lot of good closet space, which mm -hmm. was really nice. One big one for you, one small one for No, me. it was the same size. Uh -huh. Yeah, huh? look. Same oh, size. Shit. <laughs> Um, and I like that it had a lot of like built-ins and stuff like that If you have if you were on the top floor, there was a tray ceiling in the bedroom, which was really really cool feature So like in the bathroom, there's gonna be two sinks one by the shower on like closest to the kitchen and then another one that you just saw but yeah there's two sinks there washer and dryer and front hall closet which was really nice it really reminded me of the second apartment that we looked at but the layout of the kitchen was different where there was like a bar separating like the kitchen from the living area oh, instead yeah, of it yeah. being an island um but yeah then she just showed us a couple more options that we could choose from they were kind of all ranged in the same price yeah there wasn't much yeah. Difference in price, like maybe like a hundred or two hundred. So the only like thing with these apartments is, is that like with all the extra fees again, it's just like so expensive. Yeah. And like to be frank, like we do not want to be paying like over two thousand dollars to live in an apartment. Like that's not saving us any money living together at all. Because you know having like another person to split rent with, you want it like. I don't know like take advantage of that so you don't have to like spend as much money like if you were to live on your own yeah that's something that we considered and we were like i don't know it's just like even though it is prime location it's just like way too expensive so yeah that is we where we are at with the whole apartment search right now and i was honestly getting super frustrated like with christian during the whole process like finding i was with well okay <laughs> 
<laughs> I was getting frustrated at like not being able to find a place like that's like perfect that's the one but I actually found um another contender and I showed Christian it he really likes it it's way below what we were thinking we were gonna spend which was really great so stay tuned for that did you um, tell you should tell people about the house <laughs> We got scammed, she guys. She got scammed. Not really be scammed. <sighs> okay, okay, I'll I'll do. We'll do a separate video on that. What? It's gonna. It takes like two minutes. I don't to care. The story. I don't feel like doing <laughs> it in this video. All right. And it keeps people on a cliffhanger. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, the whole process of like apartment hunting has been like super different than what I was expecting. Like I wasn't expecting Christian to care as much. Well, like, yeah, because I'm living there too. Yeah, I know, but sometimes guys really don't care. Like, not this one. Yeah, not this one, guys. It's really, like I said, it's taught me a lot of patience. Um, that you still don't have. Yeah, no, I'm learning patience. You're learning it. You yes, I'm. You don't that's have it. it. You don't <laughs> have it though. Um, I was getting really frustrated, Christian, because he kept saying like, like we we'd walk into empty units, and he'd be like, I just can't picture it. I can't see it. Like I need to see furniture in there. <laughs> I'm like, Christian, why do you need to see furniture in there? Like. That's not even going to be the furniture that we're going to have anyway, or like maybe even the layout that we would have it. So like, if the it bones gives, are good, it just if gives like, you a better idea. yeah, I know that's like hard, like because I can envision like how I would decorate things, but Christian's like, no, I need to see it now, and I'm like, Ew. it was definitely like a struggle for both of us to go through this, but it's we're learning. Just, we're learning. We're we're learning more about how each other. Our tastes. He had to like get over that factor of like you won't be able to see like and you had to get over the fact that everything can't just be your way yeah uh, don't even get me yeah. started with the rugs <laughs> he doesn't like vintage looking rugs Ugh, they're so ugly i'm gonna have one in your own room <laughs> okay guys so that is it for this video hope you guys enjoyed touring some apartments with us can you scratch my back let me know which apartment you liked the best out of these two. We're definitely not moving into them, but if you guys have a favorite, let me know. And yeah, we will see you in our next moving vlog. Hopefully by then we'll have found a place and move in sometime soon. I don't know. I don't know. We are just going along. Kind of in with, limbo right now. Yeah, we're just going along with the journey and just taking it day by day. And yeah, that's it. All right, guys, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.